ओके गाइस आवर पैसेज वाज फ्रॉम टर्की टू बिथुआ व्हिच कम्स इन अल्जीरिया सो हियर इज द टर्की दिस इज इटली एंड दिस इज इन नॉर्थ अफ्रीका द पोर्ट ऑफ बिथुआ व्हिच इज आल्सो कॉल्ड आरजू पोर्ट एंड इट कम्स इन द कंट्री ऑफ अल्जीरिया सो दिस इज जिब्राल्टर स्ट्रेट एंड हियर कम्स द बिथुआ पोर्ट सो आई विल जस्ट एक्सप्लेन यू द अप्रोच एंड नेविगेशनल पार्ट how you approach this port the approach is pr uh, pretty simple we came all the way from turkey to this port and uh, from this way point the coasting starts you can see all the lighthouses on the port side and the coastal navigation starts right from here you approach straight forward to the port uh, this uh, since it comes in the mediterranean mediterranean sea Uh, this whole region comes under marpol annex 6 so as soon as you enter the port limits which is 12 nautical miles from the nearest land so this is the port limit line which we have drawn from this lighthouse ras carbon and this lighthouse over here so this is the port limit before you enter this port limit you should be on lsmgo as per marpol annex 6 so you enter this area on lsmgo both main engines and generators and uh, call the bithua port control on vhf channel 14 take the berthing instructions the pilot boats now the port comes over here over here and the pilot boats just before the breakwater which is at this position so i will just put the cursor on this position which is 3549.8 and 00 degree 13.6 minutes west so you approach uh, you approach like this you pick up the pilot over here and you uh, steady your course uh, southerly most on a southerly course so you come like this and you approach there is a green boy just just beside this breakwater so you keep this green boy on the starboard side since this region comes under isla region a the green uh, lateral marks will be on starboard side and red ones will be on the port side while entering only thing you have to uh, be careful of is of the distances from this breakwater and from this breakwater in the stern you will have to take from the duty officers in the forward and the aft stations you have north cardinal boys uh, over here and here so you can on you have only this sufficient this much sea room to pass your ships and come to this berth now before this breakwater the tugs are made fast you have one tug in the forward and one tug in the center lead aft so since we were on port side alongside our tug was made fast on the starboard bow the only thing was uh, the tug uses the ship's line so we passed our ship's line both the ends to the tug so there were two ship's lines passed to the tug made fast to the made fast uh, to the tug and then we uh, we made fast on our ship Uh, by making figure of eight on the bits so uh, once the tugs are made fast you straight away approach and as soon as you enter this breakwater you start turning your ship to starboard start turning and take your clearances from the port quarter so as soon as you come here you start turning take clearances from the uh, port quarter and you turn your ship like this the depth uh, in the channel is uh, pretty much uh, as you can see 23 meters uh, depth you have got uh, but you have less clearances uh, and less depth of water on this side so you have only this much clearances to pass your ship which is around i will just let you know it's hardly 0.2 nautical miles so point 2 nautical miles is hardly 350 360 meters so you just have 350 meters to pass your ships so the turning is uh, is you the turn which you have to make is quite uh, fast and it's it's the navigable sea width area is quite less so you 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 will have of course tug forward and made uh, aft made fast so you will uh, pilot will use the tug power also so only thing you have to make sure is the clearances from the port quarter and of course the forward will be clear so you have to keep one man in the forward and two guys in the port quarter one on the port quarter and one on the starboard quarter to see the clearance as soon as you pass this inner breakwater 
then you start turning to port slowly slowly you have sufficient clearance over here sometimes you will have ships ships uh, which are which will be berth on this uh, uh, jetties this terminal is called m6 the terminal belongs to sona track sona track company they also have got a few ships uh, so bitua is one of the largest uh, lpg and lng exporter uh, so this is one of the major uh, port in the mediterranean sea so we were berth on uh, uh, m6 we were berth uh, on port side alongside so as soon as the ship was made alongside uh, we made made fast the moorings uh, which was normally it is 422 or 322 in the forward and 422 in the aft the only thing you have to be careful is that uh, uh, first lines of course will be the springs forward and aft which goes by the boat and only thing you will have to be careful is that uh, when the ship is uh, making uh, coming alongside the berth uh, you have to make sure that the ropes uh, does not get stuck uh, in between the fenders or below the fenders uh, rest uh, the berthing is quite uh, simple and you also have less clearances in the forward so as soon as you come turn the approach speed should not be much so just align your ships as per the manifold alignment just align your ships and lower your speed even if the speed is more you can give a stern kick and align your ship and then come alongside this berth and terminal as you can see in the forward you have less depth 11 meters and all and the clearance is hardly anything